So how do we find the molar mass of chromium-3 carbonate? Well, let's take a look at the simple table to help us organize our thoughts. Bam. So the first thing I'm going to do is write down the elements I see in the compound, right? So we see chromium, we see carbon, and we see oxygen. Next is then to take into account the number of atoms of each, and that's where the subscripts come into play. So at the bottom of chromium, there's two. That means that there are two atoms of, two, two atoms of chromium. I'm combining words. Two atoms of chromium. All right, then carbon. Uh, there's one carbon inside of carbonate, but you have three carbonates, so therefore there's a total of three carbons. In other words, take the subscript of carbon there, multiply it by the outer uh, subscript to find the total, right? So that would be three. And then same thing for oxygen. Take oxygen's subscript, multiply it by the outside, so that's a total of nine oxygen's. Nice and simple. Next, then we're going to find the mass of the element. Where do we find it? Periodic table. Let's take a look. Chromium is 52. Carbon is 12.01, oxygen is 16. Those represent the masses, the magnitudes, that is. The units can be gram per molar AMU, depending upon if you're finding molar mass or molecular mass. I'm just going to plug in the magnitudes here, right? So the chromium atom weighs about 52 units of mass. Carbon is 12.01, and oxygen is going to be 16. To find the total mass, then, of the element in the compound, you simply have to multiply this row on a cross, right? So for chromium, this is simply going to be 104. For carbon, that's going to work out to be 36.03. And then for oxygen, it's just a simple 144. To then find the total mass, look, all you got to do now, very simple. Just add it all together, right? Just add it all together. This is 284.03. Since we're solving for molar mass, the units are in gram per mole. That's it. Thanks for tuning in. Now you know how to find the molar mass of chromium-3 carbonate. I'll see you in the next video. Like and subscribe if you can. It helps us out tremendously. Check out some more of our videos. We have thousands upon thousands of videos out there, different subjects, physics, mathematics, chemistry, and more coming. We'll see you soon.